The second rule I taught my kids about money was to avoid the trap of credit cards. Kids these days are sold the idea of instant gratification. As soon as young adults start making money, they're pushed and prodded by credit card companies to just use that plastic to buy whatever they want, whenever they want. The appeal of material items, vacations, and dining out can easily lead to loads of debt that quickly become a ball and chain keeping you captive to endless card payments. Although credit card companies lure customers with promos such as no interest for 90 days or no upfront fee, it's a Trojan horse. Modern money lenders are charging huge interest rates of 18% to 25%. Before you know it, the unpaid balance is up to $500, then $1,000, then $2,500. The finance charge at 21% can cost a borrower $500. That's how Visa and MasterCard rack up their profits. When you only pay the minimum amount due each month, that unpaid balance grows larger and larger until you've hit your limit. I've witnessed far too many people become shackled by credit card debt and can't make positive progress steps towards financial independence. The best way to avoid credit card debt is to live by a monthly budget and avoid overspending. If you remember, rule number one is only live on 80% of your take-home pay. When constructing a budget plan for fixed expenses and variable expenses, go ahead and allot yourself a small amount for discretionary spending but stick with cash or a debit card so that when you've used up your money for the month, you're done. My wife and I were dirt poor when we started out and the only assets we had were love, school loans, and car loans. We made a budget, discussed it together, and tried our best to follow it. We only had one credit card for emergencies, an American Express card, because you are forced to pay the entire balance every month. Little by little, we stayed disciplined, got the student loans paid off, and saved enough money to start our own business. Our Tulsa Wealth Advisors branch with Raymond James is top 25 in the nation. And it all started by avoiding credit cards and learning to live within our means.